everyone. Um, welcome to another Danny's World. Um, yeah, I just got home. I was at the grocery store. And yeah, I always want to film in there, but it's so busy and the people are so judgmental there. It's like, I should just pull out the camera and be like, hey, I'm here at the grocery store. But maybe one day, once you see the grocery store uh, vlog, then that'd be, I'm, that's perfect. Hmm. But I went to Starbucks and these videos are broken up in different days. Maybe I should put that, I don't know. And put was like, how many times are you going to go to Starbucks in one day? I don't know if he's being serious though. How do I know sometimes the people? I don't know. But yeah, I'm no, I've been to Walmarts every day. Gonna go tonight. Um, they had nothing again yesterday. Went to both Walmarts. I went to the comic shop, got some stuff. Show that off later, but um, yeah. Um, yeah, new Carnage is out, which is cool. <laughs> And yeah, I don't know, man. I'm just trying to vlog it up. Uh, yeah, it's been dry. It's, yeah, it's just like all the shelves are bare. It sucks. <laughs> but yeah, I picked up some mail. I was out. Didn't film it because I was just in a rush. But yeah, I got something from Big Bad Toy Store. So let's slice that open as good as we can. One-handed power. Oh, look at my cat. Don't be camera shy. Baby. Come here. Yeah. You like that weird talk, don't you? Charmander. <laughs> oh, yeah. This is one that I've been waiting for. So, yeah. Um, Super 7 Baxter Stockman. We should take a look at him out of the box, but... Um, yeah, but yeah, they package it pretty well. It comes in that brown box as well, so. Let's uh, see what it looks like, though. <laughs> Excited. They, these Super 7 ones are killing it. They just look amazing like the original toys, which is really cool. So there's this purple uh, sleeve on it. Oh, look how good that looks with the purple on the back. Ninja Turtles. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. <laughs> and then, yeah, I'll pull the slip off. Can I do that one-handed? Oh yeah, I had this figure as a kid, so that's why I wanted to get it. I'm not getting all of these, but they're just so good. They're like exactly, well, almost exactly like the original releases in just a new style. I think this was the reissue one, different packaging. But yeah, Baxter Stockman, you can pause that and read that if you care. Yeah, I didn't, I just have Raphael Leonardo. Um, I should have got the Shredder. But something about the Shredder one was just off to me. I want the Splinter though, I might have to do that. But yes, this Baxter is so good. Yeah, fantastic. It's super dope. <laughs> I'm really excited to get this actually. That looks really cool. It's super cool, mate. Yes, it's so cool. <laughs> um, Yeah, but like I said, I really want that Splinter. I'll have to see how much it is. <laughs> Should check right now. It's probably pretty expensive. But yeah, the Shredder, um, yeah, passing the Shredder, I need the other turtles. I think I have Donnie and Mikey uh, pre-ordered, but they won't be out till like the end of the year. But these Super 7s, man, like I like them more than the NECA, even though I haven't got my hands on them because I haven't boxed any of them just because of like health and time and it sucks, man. But I'll get back on that. But these guys, they need to be displayed. They need to be out of the packaging. They're just too dope. But yeah, um, yeah, they're just like the old toys from back in the day. So that's really cool. I'm working on some review stuff. It's just health and energy wise. Been, you know, I've been burnt, but I'm just trying to get back on track. But yeah, uh, these Danny Worlds are doing well. So got to continue those. I actually do want to show off the other ones. Um, Nerdpool got me the uh, Raphael from OnlyFans. So, um, yeah, pop his. Thing up now. Go we'll give him a follow, everybody. That'd be hella dope. But yeah, there's the Raphael. Super cool. I might have shown this off or posted it on Instagram or something, but yeah, just so good. And then yeah, here's the Leo, which is just as badass. Oh, these ones take me back. I just don't want to rush, like, <laughs> I want to have a nice place to display these guys. I am getting a new setup, like, in my living room and the other shelf, so hopefully I can put some stuff on the shelf, like I said. I'm trying to sell some stuff off. It's hard. Harder than you think. Um, probably have to use eBay at one point, but just unloading some of the stuff locally, you know, local selling stuff for, for now. So that's cool. actually been moving some of it, mostly the gaming stuff. That's what I've been selling off, and that's what I want to sell off. <laughs> Not everything, like I said, I want to keep all my games that I love, my anime games, the games I actually play, but yeah, I kind of got crazy there. I think everyone did. You know, it was so fun to hunt stuff down and games, but like then the, you know, 
COVID happened, um, you know, I couldn't hunt as much. And then the game prices like inflated overnight. Like yeah, I went to the pawn shops, stuff I was easily getting for like, you know, 20, 30, 40 bucks was like 70, 80, 100. It's just like, ooh. And like, I've been collecting video games, retro games for like what, seven, eight years now. So it's like, you know, I was getting some dirt cheap seven, eight years ago. And now it's like, eh, it's hyped. So, but yeah. It is what it is. I don't, I just want to use, buy stuff, you know. So I like the toys. You know, I've always been a toy person growing up. Always had a lot of action figures. And I like them. They do what you do. You buy them, you pose them, you open them, you enjoy them. That's what they're for. And that's what they do. But yeah, um, it's just like, like I said, I was trying, wasn't going to complete, obviously, a complete um, PS2 or DS collection. But I was just picking up so much stuff at one point abundance of stuff and it's not worth anything like the junk but i still just got to get rid of it um it, just take it to a pawn shop maybe um at the junk or like you know try to do bundles throw some good games in there but yeah maybe some of that junk people might like i don't know it's hard to know but that's where i'm at with that and yeah trying to just sell stuff do the hustles so many hustles lately hustling like a little hussy <laughs> Yeah, those are the turtles. Like I said, check out Deadpool. He's got a podcast. Uh, Nerd Deadpool. He's got a podcast. I'm going to be on it soon, hopefully. And yeah, all that stuff. But um, yeah, collecting. I don't know what I'm doing this week. Um, besides hitting the Walmarts, I will hit the Walmarts. But yeah, I'll show you guys what's happening. Um, I'll probably do some toy hunting, even if it's more bare shelves, more disappointment. I need you to bear with me with these bare shelves. The disappointment. <laughs> <laughs> but I always got stuff coming in. Like I said, I went to the comic shop yesterday. Got to show off that those comics this week. Might pick up more, so maybe I'll do that all at once. But more toy haul, more chilling, and all that. Thanks for checking out these videos. I highly appreciate it. And yeah, I'll see you in a little bit. <laughs> or in a few seconds. <laughs> well, outside another Walmart, ready to get disappointed. <laughs> see it? Can you see the Walmart? Yeah, I filmed at the other Walmart. Even though I checked this one that day too, um, I didn't film in there because it's absolutely nothing. But I will show you today is <laughs> Thursday. So now you guys, I'll tell you what day it is just so you don't think I'm drinking eight Starbucks in one day. <laughs> but yeah, I'd probably go to Starbucks later today. But yeah, I'm going to go check out this Walmart. Be extremely disappointed as per usual. So stick with me and I love you. <laughs> Alrighty, let's check out Walmart, see what we can find today. Look how happy I look in Walmart. It's like my natural habitat hunting toys. <laughs> and right off the bat, you can tell the Transformers section is abysmal. They have nothing. Oh, look, a rat trap uh, kingdom figure. Who cares? And who cares about the, this guy? And yeah, I mean, a core optimist. Who cares? Ugh. Yeah, 86 stuff, nothing in um, studio series. Um, we have all the Cyberverse junk, uh, this stuff, and this red Megatron who's been here for weeks, I keep seeing it. I already have one, so I do not want it. Uh, yes. Oh, they have this guy, but I already have it, and yes, I should not be buying Cyberverse stuff. Uh, and Kingdom Optimus, who nobody wants, and he's always around. <laughs> Uh, it's really disappointing. No new McFarlane stuff. I did get some stuff from Toys R Us recently, but they have nothing here. Uh, yeah, Marvel Legends Frog Boy, as always. This wave is sticking around more than usual. Look at all these Wolverines. They got Wolverines for days. <laughs> I'm in a daze by all these Wolverines. <laughs> uh, Star Wars, nothing. G.I. Joe's, nothing. Just the same old, same old. They could not stock the shelves. If they tried, yeah, nothing for Star Wars, Baby Yoda's for days. Is the hype over? <laughs> uh, they got the Cobra Fang though, but yeah, I never see any of the other smaller G.I. Joe stuff anytime. And yeah, nothing for wrestling, no cool new diva figures or nothing. <laughs> they have nothing. <laughs> Masters of the Universe, yeah, I'm not collecting this stuff. I just bought a She-Ra, but that's all. And yeah, like I said, look at this. It's so sad to see how empty it is. Look at me. I'm so disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe it. They have nothing ever. It's just, it's sad, you know. Uh, Halo, uh, Mega Constructs, um, yeah, Captain America, Venoms for Days, Apex Legends, who cares? <laughs> 
Power Rangers, if they had some new lightning uh, stuff, I'd be down, but I already have this one, and yeah, I don't need that, so... Yeah, but yeah, it's the only lonely little lightning Power Ranger they have. Cards are bare. Pokemon's on that craze. Adventure Force, this is for you, Crimson Raptors. These are for all you. And this dinosaur, too. I'm not even going to say that name because, yeah, <laughs> I'll look stupider than I already am. But I do know Albertosaurus. That's the province next to me. And yeah, some God, uh, Zilla, Space Godzillas. I mean, they're just fun to look at. I'm just showing this stuff because... There's nothing else to film, and I made it all the way out here, so, ah! And oh, look, a Spinosaurus. I'd like to dine, find dine with a Spinosaurus. I actually like this Spinosaurus, but I can't get into dinosaur stuff, because that would just be insane. Leave that to Crimson. Look at me. I'm trying to have fun. I'm trying to enjoy myself. Looking at the clearance stuff. A Scarlet Spider, but it's just those bendy flex guys. Who cares? Yeah, um, Battle Cat or whatever. 14 bucks, so... Yeah, there's that. <laughs> For where, yeah, and then all this weird stuff. Um, Mama Joey? Ugh, God. And look, a $44 uh, Jar Jar Binks in clearance. <laughs> I wonder if it really is $44. That would be depressing. As I don't get um, Black Series stuff. Let's test it out. How much are you, Jar Jar? $44. Canadian. That's insane. No way am I spending that. Uh, Cave Club? Something tells me I would have liked that as a kid, but that's just... Oh, here you go. This is for our man, M3 Reviews. This is, uh, yeah, shout out to Marcus, M3 Reviews. Check out these dolls, bro. <laughs> I mean, I would have loved these dolls as a kid, because, like, I always wanted to be a hoe, so... But, yeah, M3 Reviews, check out his channel. He loves dolls. <laughs> they got some Halo stuff sticking around. Some newer, a couple new guys from the new wave. I sent mine to Brian, though. Um, these elites are cool. If they were the bigger part, like in that newer series, I wouldn't mind some of those elites. But, I mean, they are what they are. I can't, I already bought them and gave them away. I'm like, I'm done. I can't get into all these different series. But it's cool that they have it here. You know, the Warthog looks pretty cool. And this Pokemon stuff, I mean, it is what it is. I love Wartoidal, though. Wartoidal! <laughs> He's one of my favorites. He's such a cutie pie. <laughs> well, I tried my best. Like I said, it's like I drove all the way here to the West of Kelowna. <sighs> Walmart and yeah, had no luck. So the other Walmart's on the other side of town. I might go check that out, get a coffee at least, maybe hit another store just to make my outing worth it. I think I gotta go to the grocery store. Like I said, can't really film in there much because it's just so busy and people are so like, oh my god, why is she vlogging? But yeah, that's the update. Another disappointment at Walmart. They had nothing. Gotta check every day because once it hits, you'll never see the Netflix stuff. So kind of getting burnt out uh, i didn't check yesterday hopefully it didn't drop hopefully someone else checked i don't know uh. well another day another walmart <laughs> da -da -da -da. well 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 another walmart ready to be disappointed <laughs> here we go and yes highly disappointed right off the bat um yeah like it's pretty sad you know i know like even this cyberverse stuff seems to be dwindling and yeah that can tell you the state of what we're in i wish they had more i mean i think they should have a little more stuff let's toss that superman <laughs> like nothing uh yeah but nothing for studio series yeah these kid figures ah uh, there's nothing ever it's so sad but yeah m3 don't worry check out the, the dolls <laughs> they're supplied up on dolls on this walmart as well so you can come here anytime homie and we can go shopping for some nice dolls i actually like that one it's kind of cool the purple but yeah man they got your dolls don't worry we're stocked up on dolls m3 <laughs> You know, it's all just for fun and love, you know, um, I love the Transformers community, love you guys, it's all for fun, but yeah. <laughs> Whoa, people are driving like crazy in the rain, it's raining, see? Can you see the rain drops? I love the rain! <laughs> Yeah, anyway, that Walmart was a bust. They absolutely had nothing. Nothing! So, yeah, both Walmarts checked. Nothing. Um, yeah, just in the Starbucks line. Gotta pull up. Hold on. But, yeah, like, at what cost, you know? Like, um, I gotta do this probably a couple more weeks just to get the Netflix stuff. <laughs> like I said, I could just order them off eBay, but I want to find them in the store. I want to find them, you know, 
you know, find them. Oh, excuse me, bubbly had me freaking bubbled up. Buble! <laughs> But I want to find them in the wild, you know? <laughs> that would be cool. <laughs> but yeah, I don't know. Just another day. Don't think anything came in at Toys R Us. The truck's supposed to be there Friday. So today's Thursday. So probably wait on that. <sighs> but yeah, grocery store. Then edit and work on stuff when I get home. Just whatever. Nothing too crazy, crazy. <laughs> Get some Starbucks. <laughs> Brighten up the day. But yeah, I tried to do. Went to the gym yesterday. Just gonna hang out today. A little tired, but I still not feeling great. But hey, it is what it is. And yeah, I'll have an update. Probably show some stuff off at home later today, and all that. So yeah. Well, I got my Starbucks. <laughs> mm. I guess grocery store. Get some stuff for. Uh, yeah, maybe make some quesadillas or something. <laughs> I don't cook a lot of stuff, but I'd make a few things. <laughs> I don't wonder I'm alone, but yeah, I'll update you a bit. And then maybe I'll show off some of those uh, Carnage comics I picked up at home. Or I picked up uh, from the comic shop yesterday that are at home. And yeah, that'll be it for today. But yeah, gotta love your Starbucks and your Starbucks hoe. <laughs> hey, look at that cool display. That's pretty neat for Easter. Um, Yeah, Matt actually filming in a... <laughs> grocery store because i'm insane <laughs> gotta get cat food for luna so yeah he likes his stuff with gravy nothing else will do with, for this boy so <laughs> get a stack of that yep <laughs> and then cheese for the quesadillas ah uh, yes who wants quesadillas and this dolphin <laughs> uh, look at me i'm i'm insane but it's okay it's fun to film in a grocery store look they even have toys like ruby that's really cool some ruby tuesday and look they even have some siege uh mini bots so that's really cool i think i'll grab a couple of them it says they're like 5.99 so yay hey just chilling at home now i was filming the grocery store and my GoPro batteries died so i mean i tried yeah i found these for like five bucks some siege stuff so i thought that was kind of cool not bad. I mean, just at the grocery store, so that's interesting. I never have enough of those, I thought, or sealed ones. And then, yeah, I recently got this Mortal Kombat a Sub Zero. I don't think I showed that off. McFarlane line. Yeah, I probably shouldn't be collecting these, but a purple Sub Zero. I mean, I gotta have it. And another Scorpion. <laughs> Hopefully, I can display these one day in a better way because you know <laughs> it sucks just not having a room in this house and then yeah some of the new comics just this back to the future transformer one oh the new harley quinn series where she's trying to um you know redeem herself and become a hero it's kind of cool power rangers can't go wrong and then yeah these carnage some of these are the exclusive covers so that's really cool carnage this one's really cool. I always like Carnage, Maniac. I know some people don't like Carnage. Overrated, but I don't mind. Some Carnage in my life. <laughs> and then, yeah, this X-Men Cable Run. So, yeah, this is really cool. I'm going to keep them in order. X-Factor. And, yeah, I got this for, like, 50 bucks. So, pretty good. Really like the art on there. Yeah, I'm just kind of a cover collector. Stuff I like. I mean, this was a bundle they had. So, anything like that, I'll jump on once I can. So, and yeah, I'm an X Man fan. <laughs> there we go. Another one. Yeah, it's really cool art. Yeah, I really like this one with Angel and Apocalypse. It's one of my favorite covers of the bond. She looks so cool. Angel looks cool. Love those dark faces. Yeah. Nice to add to the collection. <laughs> Bunch of comics. That's what I bought. Yeah, I went to Starbucks today. Uh, yeah, I went both Walmarts. Went, I think yesterday I didn't go because it was just so burnt, but... 
pretty much there was nothing apparently. And I went today, <laughs> both Walmarts, grocery shopping, and my energy's already low, but what can I say? I just really want those Netflix Transformers, and if that's the way we have to do it, going every day, because if you stop going, then you'll miss out. Uh, why can't they stock the shelves? But, I mean, I understand they're not going to have, like, so many, but, I don't know, Wave 1 for Netflix, I did see a lot more. Wave 2, I only saw the day I got it. <laughs> Basically, and that's it. <laughs> Except for a random, uh, what did I see? A random Soundwave Netflix recently just sitting on the shelf. Nothing else, nothing from that other Netflix line. Just a, a random Soundwave sitting there. So they must have pulled it out of the back or something. Like I said, slowly get back into some review style stuff. Plus the Dannys. And then, yeah, there's not a bit in a lot of news. Like, I don't know, the Galvatron. Like, I was stoked for it, the first pictures I seen. I, the proportions looked a little strange. I know people are saying it's probably the lens, but maybe it was the lens on all the pictures. It's hard to tell. Like, he just looks more chunky, stocky. I think uh, Enput said he looked like a line backer. And, yeah. And he just looks, yeah, I like the upper half. I mean, he, he does look a little wide and chunky and big, but... I mean, his legs now just look stubby and short. It makes him look awkward, but hey, who knows? Is it just the sh shots? Maybe we'll get more shots. More people will get more reviews, but he just looks slightly unproportioned. <laughs> and yeah, I, I want to love the Galvatron, but I'm not gonna, just going to do a video on that. So here's my opinion. I hope it doesn't look as distorted as it looks. I mean, I uh, don't want to hate it, you know. Um, you know, of course I wanted it to be the darker blue like the movie. Purple, dark, purpley blue. But, um, yeah. But I, I thought, first I thought the figure looked really good. So hopefully, um, <laughs> hopefully it will. I think it's causing a little ups upset in the community. Um, hopefully it, yeah, we'll see when you see it. But he does look a little strange and chunky and awkward. But hey, I can relate. <laughs> But yeah, I don't know what else. I just made dinner. Like I said, I don't really cook that much. I usually am a skip the dishes type of person. I mean, it's depressing cooking for one person when you're just cooking for yourself and you live alone. It's pretty depressing. <laughs> like, I really am alone. <laughs> yeah, cooking. Um, yeah, I mean, quesadillas is one of the things I can make. I'll make you some quesadillas, mate. But <laughs> and then, yeah, um, gym yesterday. Didn't go today, just kind of tired from all the Walmarts and grocery shopping and being out. But, um, yeah, I guess I'll see what I'm going to do tonight. I think my mom is going to see my sister, so I'll stop by and say hello. And then, yeah, um, just see how I'll feel tomorrow. i got to work. Friday, i got to work. And then gym. And then, yeah. But, yeah, hopefully, like I said, get in the swing of things, some more news clips, discussion videos. I think me and Wilbur have a video uh, next week planned kind of thing. So, I'm um, watching for that. And, yeah, lots of other things in the mix. Always on the hunt. If I find something uh, in the next couple days before I post this, I'll add that in. But otherwise, yeah, see you in a bit. <laughs> or a few seconds. Oh, my God, guys. I'm at the Walmart. I didn't film because, like... They had someone give me a tip that stuff might be in the boxes, like I said, and I got this guy to go through the boxes. They had two leaders. Um, one of them was Megatron, uh, the uh, dinosaur. Yeah, and the other one was Kingdom Ultra Magnus. So going <laughs> every day for two weeks basically paid off. I got that Ultra Magnus. So I'm so happy, but yeah, nothing else. I asked the guy, what's up with the Transformers? How come you're not getting more? Like, I didn't even film in there, man. I'm still can't even breathe. Like, oh, oh yeah, the other drama was it did that thing where the guy scanned it and it came, in, came up as nothing. So the guy had to like put it into the system. Sometimes they don't do that. Sometimes they're not nice. I tried to put on my little like voice like, excuse me, sir, help me, I'm a little trans. And yeah, they put it through the system. I got it. I th didn't think I was gonna get it. I was freaking panicking. My heart is racing so hard right now. I can't believe I got it. <laughs> Ultra Magnus in Walmart. It pays off to go every day. But yeah, I wouldn't have known. Like homie told me, check. They had a crate there, so I went back. That was around seven. It is. It's Friday. It's 9:50, 8:51. Went there, got it. So I can't believe it. Um, that paid off. I'm ecstatic. I have some other stuff to show off at home that I got today, and then, yeah, I think I'll wrap this video up. But my heart is pounding, but yeah, if I didn't get that tip, I wouldn't have got this. Walmart paid off. Ultra Magnus, baby. <laughs> well, it's still Friday. I'm home. Just got back from uh, 
yeah, out and about. Um, yeah, today, like I said, I just, I'm just, I can't believe I got that Ultra Magnus. My heart is just like, <laughs> I'm, it's crazy. <laughs> but today I also picked up some Amiibo. So I got Terry, show these off quickly. Someone's calling me, hold on. My sister, hold on. <laughs> Hello? Hello? <laughs> I'm okay, how are you? <laughs> got distracted, sister call. Well, I got Bailiff or Byleth, whatever you said, the other amiibo. Byleth, I think. So that's kind of cool. Still get some amiibos when I can. And of course, the Banjo Kazooie amiibo just came out. So I picked that up as well. Amiibo! <laughs> and then, um, yeah. Another Cobra Infantry Trooper came in, picked that up, got lucky with that. I um, still haven't seen the other Target exclusives. I, I mean, because I'd see them at Toys R Us, but hopefully we'll get um, the Cobra Viper and stuff. I really want those figures, but um, yeah, no Targets here, so <laughs> we'll see. And then Zartan I've got, so let me show that better. <laughs> so yeah, that rings there. The ring of light, but yeah, Zartan. Nice belly top on a man. <laughs> I don't know, whatever. And then, um, I can't believe I bought this too. Why did I do this? This is a shout out to you Bayformers fans. I got the 4K Transformers the movies. I don't know, maybe I'll just have them on his background or something, you know? <laughs> I'm not the biggest fan, don't mind the first one, you know. Whatever, I'll put it on. You know, maybe if I ever enter any entertain some friends, I'll be like, hey, let's put this on, bro. <laughs> and then, of course, tonight, I got lucky. You know, got that tip from a friend, to ch uh, you know, that they had, you know, uh, a whatever skid of figures. So I got that Ultra Marcus. And yeah, that worked out. <laughs> I had to get the guy, I was yelling at the guy to like dig through it. Or I just asked him, I was like, you know, can you um, check these Transformers boxes for me? It's really hard to find this stuff, really hard to get this stuff. Guy checked it and yeah, like I said, uh, uh, did I say that earlier? I'm not, can't remember, but yeah, it had Megatron and just Ultra Mark. Ultra Marcus? Shout out to you, Ultra Marcus. You're always on my mind, buddy. But uh, they had Ultra Magnus. <laughs> Hopefully I haven't been saying Ultra Marcus the whole time, but yeah, gotta love Ultra Marcus and Ultra Magnus. Both very, very spiffy men. <laughs> Jeez, man, I'm such a goofball. But yeah, <laughs> love the community. I think that's it for this week's of Danny's World. You know, I don't know much more I can take or what I'm gonna do. Of course, more Danny's World's coming out. Thank you for checking these video out. videos out. They're doing really well. Highly appreciate it. And yeah, I hope everyone's... I'm t staying safe and all that. Um, news clips should be out this week. And like I said, trying to get back on some reviews in the mix sooner than later. Hold out on me. They don't do that well anyway. So I know like people probably aren't missing them that much. But like I said, I want to share some of my fun <laughs> and passion for reviewing stuff and some insight on figures. So look forward to that. More Danny's World, more news clips and all that. So as per usual, everyone, take care, stay strong, stay safe. And I'll catch you in the next episode or video, y'all. Goodbye. Thank mm -hmm. you.